gonna be weird. Okay. So what was this? This was harp. This is harp. Harp for harp. the harp. <laughs> harp for the harp god. Yes, you did. I saw you steal a man off a raft just last week. What's he doing? What's that thing? I like the fact these harpies are like what? nagging. Bickering <laughs> creatures. Okay, yep, so very quick footnote, I guess, just to reference the fact that we did complete this game almost, and then it crashed during the recording, so we're just going to do it again. But, you know, I guess we could have gone through it and just it made it seem like we know. We're just like sav savants oh, of kings of this last section, and just <laughs> <laughs> like we're both we're both directly and directly hooked into the internet. Yeah, just see it, all, just just go. Working out all the answers. Yeah. Graham quickly uh, bent down. We played so much King's Quest now that we just no. yeah we we know the inner workings of everything. But yeah. Just for the sake of honesty. <laughs> just say just say things like, oh, pick up that fish hook, fish hook from the ground. <laughs> <laughs> so I can tell from that one pixel that it's a fish hook. Uh, I'm going to leave him again. Yeah. Well, we need to pick up that shell first. Yeah, I mean, I don't think it's a first. I guess, I don't know. Could, you, well, would, it, could we handle it. it? Yeah, could we handle an extra item? I wouldn't put the game, put it past the game to like, up the beautifully colored shell. just miss it. Or to kill us. Yeah, just to kill it because like you'd you'd put him you'd carry him, you'd automatically push the boat out, then wanna come back, and then you'll get picked up by a harpy and No, I think it would be like you are currently holding Cedric. Graham is unable to cope with the concept of how to pick up and handle two items at the same time and you stand there until you starve to death. <laughs> the end. I think you drop Cedric and then be like, <laughs> oh no, you've killed Cedric. <laughs> Game over. Help me. Why is he like this, actually? Where do you hurt? He got smacked by a harpy, right? Where, where, Did where? he? End of season. Se season? Session <laughs> three. End of season. Oh my god, can you imagine? <laughs> I, don't, I don't want to. I regretted saying that word the second it came out of my mouth. Okay. You still got your map? Uh, yes. So we mapped everything. Mapped. Again, we're not prescient. We died lots. But it's just this sea monster. It's all been seen. Yeah, left and up. And then left all the way. I got a question. Do you reckon it's worth just going straight? Uh, up. up. Oh. No, don't go straight. No, I mean, um. Uh, yeah, left all the way. See, there are there's still elements of peril. <laughs> The other thing I was thinking is that I'm not going to save because I'm being so gung ho now, and that's going to screw us over. I think. Yeah, in the labyrinth it will. There's some timing elements. Was there? Uh, well, there's timing elements with the um, with the blue thing. The blue thing. Well, I don't know what it's called. <laughs> blue thing. Okay. Yeah, like, I don't know if we actually need to go down here or whether we could just go down straight. You probably could go straight to him. You could probably. You yeah. know what? I'm gonna... It's one screen. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just do it as we do it. A makeshift house fashioned from the bow of a wrecked ship occupies the south end of a small narrow beach. <sighs> doing on my beach? I'm King Graham of Daventry, and I'm on a journey to find the wizard Mordax Island, but I seem to be stuck. I don't know where to go from here. Hey, what's that you say? Yeah, conch. What's this? Now, what were you wanting? My owl friend is hurt. He was wounded by the harpies. Wounded by the harpies, did you say? Well, if you bring him to me, I'll fix him right up. Good as new. 
Right. Well, it's nice that this old old hermit has skills. Yeah, skills can heal. Can heal. Uh... I assume he's hermit by choice. Straight down. Yeah, straight down. We're safe here. And then left. Well, this screen has to be so large you would never be able to. Get <laughs> Just wouldn't be able to get to <laughs> Design floor. Came back, eh? Bring your friend on in here and I'll see if I can heal him up. Come on, I mean, Cedric. I, I take offense that he's being referred to as our friend. Lay That's true. We don't need to tell this guy our backstory with this. These poultices should fix the little fella up good as new. He's more of a responsibility than a colleague. The wizard will be mad if we kill him. Ooh, I'm feeling better already. Tell me, what was in those poultices? My employer would be very interested in them. How close to death does he come? Hey, what was that? How many times has he come what close was to death? Poultices? My employer would be well, interested in them. Is it just these two? Is it just the two lad. I think so. Ain't nothing special. He, he was you just gotta parallel. know how to use them. Yeah, I don't think no, he didn't do anything. No, son. What was it you were trying to tell me before? I was trying to it's find out constantly where shocking to me how island is. how stacked Crane is with his grey hair get to them and his silly late. hat. Oh, I'm right sorry to hear about that. He's a nasty one, that Mordak. I wouldn't want to tangle close. with him. I try to talk you out of going there, because I can see you can't leave your poor defenseless family unaided. I can Super enlist pointy, the one who you straight to his island. Follow me outside. Like, I don't know what the look is. Sort of fat. his pants are the same colour as his hat. Well, we do get to see them, don't we? Hello? Pearl! This man needs your help! He needs you to lead him to Mordax Island! It's a real emergency! Mordax holding his family hostage! Pearl can't speak human talk, but she's agreed to help you! Just get on into your boat and follow her. Cedric and I want to thank you for all your help, Mr. Uh... Don't worry about who I am. You just get on over to that there island and take care of your family. Aye, aye, sir. We're off. Come on, Cedric. No names. It's better that way. Yeah, then. <laughs> Let's keep this strictly professional. <laughs> then he can be brought back as a surprise in later games. It's only really one more left. Sad times. I'm feeling kind of. Oh, it's gonna, it's gonna hurt. Wistful. Yeah, for the days last year. <laughs> yeah, I mean we've played a lot of Kingsmas games. Mm. Now. This is a cool island. Break <laughs> yourself, Cedric. <laughs> Straight into panic mode. Watch for the rocks by going straight into them. <laughs> Can't possibly avoid them. Help me, I'm caught. Oh, help. This doesn't count as peril. Are you alright, no. Cedric? <laughs> no, 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 that's, yeah, that's not what I'm referring to. That counts as titting about. Oh, I'm fine, Graham. Just a bit ruffled is all. Fishy, fishy. Uh, a dead fish. Well, maybe I can use it. <laughs> <laughs> he's what he's he's well versed in what he needs to do. Oh, he's been doing it for years. Yeah. Well, kind of. I'm going to save. Oh, you are going to save. I'm going to save. Well, because I'm at about to approach a junction where I could fall off something. <laughs> so, yeah, yes. safety first. Oh, oh yeah. Ooh, I don't like this place. It's creepy. I just... Man, going through this a second time... Mm hmm I just... I still so hate Cedric so much. Ah. He's, uh... He's just got an annoying voice. It's a... Do. That's pretty badass. That was cool. Like, that was cool. It's kind of weird that 
as a security system, I don't know. I, it's it's very big on statement. Yeah, uh, this guy is compensating, I think. Well, it looked like there's no way in. <laughs> Let's come back. He's a real snake theme, isn't he? Yeah. I mean, this island's just demonic looking, though. Yeah, it really is a change of tone, like from. Let's go back now. I don't know how long we were sailing for. No, I'll figure this out. What could we possibly use? I think a stick will do. <laughs> That dark hole. You're a maniac! You don't know what's down there! Well, do you have any better ideas? No, uh, mind if I wait for you here? No, that's a good idea, Cedric. You be the lookout out here. But uh, yes! I'll be the lookout! Ooh, be careful, Graham! Hey, that's nice, because now we just don't have to deal with them. Yeah, bit of a break. Until right. he. <laughs> comes back. Do you remember the path or do you want me to guide you? Uh, just guide me. I don't remember the right, path. Left. Forward. I know it's blue right. guy. In fact, this is just straight. You can't. Okay. There's no it's other just... choices. <laughs> no branching paths on this bit. I have to say, oh. Was it tambourine? Mm -hmm. Yeah, tambourine. We used the tambourine on the snake as well, didn't we? That's what. I don't actually remember. We... Yeah, didn't you no, shake? Didn't. I thought you shook the tambourine to scare the snake off. Well, I did. Yeah, oh, it, yeah, what, ages ago? Yeah yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, we did. Yeah. Where did we get the tambourine from? Uh, the, the gypsy wagon left it behind. Oh, it's just on the floor. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So you need that tambourine to get out of that little area. All right, that's yeah. cool. I was thinking about that earlier, thinking what is the trigger point to get you out of that first section, which I then, where you then have this issue of being locked out of stuff if you didn't do everything. Yeah. And it's uh, after the gypsy disappears. So, the, okay, All right, fair enough. Which means you have to do the witch. Uh, what? The witches are later on. You have to do the witch, though, because you need to grab the magic medallion from the from Graham the reaches down and grabs teller. the hairpin off the labyrinth floor. While well, they're still there, and then you go into the witch, which gives you... Is that right? No, because which witch, you to... which witch do we mean? Oh, you mean the witch the... in the um in the in the first area? Yeah, yeah. in the woods. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm yeah. getting confused with like the frost queen. No, 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 not the not the, the, the... Um, ice, ice queen, whatever. What yeah, her name was. She's the mid boss. Yeah. All right, I'll take us back. Yeah, I still don't understand why the tambourine works for this guy. Like. But again, what's the input that leads you to that conclusion, okay, right? So you want right, left, forward, left, Le left, left, ah! <laughs> right, left, right, and then left. Then left, and then just keep going. Yeehaw! And where do we pick this up from? That we got from the rock's nest, if you remember it. When we were in, trapped in that nest just before the eagle came to help us, there was a glittery thing we picked up, and that was that. What did we get in the Harpies Island? We got the fish hook and the 
conch shell. Okay. Man. Alright. Graham inserts the hairpin into the door's large keyhole. Oh look, I just instinctively knew that door was locked. That it fits perfectly. <laughs> Turning it ever so gently, you oh, soon hear a soft click, make the exit and open. the door is unlocked. Well, the labyrinth should do the job. They ha should have the confidence in their labyrinth to let the door be unlocked. Yeah, I mean... Otherwise, otherwise why have the labyrinth? Admittedly, <laughs> otherwise it's not really much more than just a prison cell, is it? Mm hmm. I sure am hang hungry for a hope there's a bag of crappy Graham's peas. Eyes fall upon a bag of dried peas. Reaching into the open cupboard, Graham retrieves the bag of dried peas. And again, I think I'm gonna save. Maybe I'll save after I talk to the lady? Yeah, fair enough. Alright, so, yeah, okay. There's no point pretending we haven't done this before. I'm not interested in maintaining any illusions. I would never hurt you. I'd like to help you. I don't believe you. You're probably one of them. I'm not. Believe me. Just How does he away. know what them are? Please. I don't, <laughs> I don't even know. What, I don't even know what them is. I'm <laughs> not instance. one of them. Whatever they are. Um. Uh, yeah. Yeah, and I'm uh, still not happy with this. So there's a couple of puzzles here, well, more than a couple, where I feel like there's just no clue to lead, to get you there, like... Yeah, so you're either I just mean, randomly are trying, or you're relying on old-fashioned sexism. Warning, yeah. this cartoon contains material that may be necessary... To get the job done. Wherever did you find my gold locket? I thought it was gone for good. I lost it on the island just after I was brought here by Mordak. You wouldn't believe me even if I told you. But tell me, who are you and how did you come to be here? My name is Princess Katima from the Kingdom of the Green Isles. My father, the king, employs a horrible wazir who befriended Mordak. When Mordak saw me, he immediately wished to marry me and bring me here. Naturally, I refused. And my father agreed with me. But our refusal angered him so much that he stole me here anyway and put me to work as a scullery girl. He says he will never let me go. That a scullery girl I will remain until I agree to marry him. But the thought revolts me. What am I to do? Don't worry. I'm here to save my family from the evil wizard. He's got them here someplace imprisoned inside a glass bottle. If I can manage to rescue them, then of course I wouldn't forget you either. I know the glass bottle you're talking about. It's in Mordak's laboratory upstairs. Keep quiet about my presence. Uh, I think this will be the most difficult part of my journey. I may not survive it. I would never give you away. And I will help you in any way I can, kind sir. There we go. I've got a friend. Now to just get caught. Yeah, so there was nothing to pick up in here, was there? And we need yeah, to get really caught did. before we deal yeah, with that. We deal with him. That super blue guy. Yeah. The super blue guy. <laughs> so blue. He's that's his this defy. Seems pretty good for it. I mean, yeah, I, I just here, and you? don't take him down. <laughs> Come at me! Ah. Hmm. See, that's right, because you get a little mouse, he runs down a hole, so you know there's a hole there, right? Graham can see a small, moldy piece of cheese just gives you something to go on. It gives you a path to follow, a thread to follow. Yeah, I Green agree that the, the finding the of the cheese, cheese is fine, but the cheese use is not fine. No. 
be easy to it there. either. Got it. That you the can't ever have worked out how you, that you need to use. From the mouth hole. No, you just again it becomes a trial of just randomly selecting objects. Hello. <laughs> hey. What? 